Hey, today in this video, I want to tell you about the best software in the SEO tools category. Having tested a huge number of services in this category, I can say with confidence that this site is the most reliable. Any tool that can drive leads to a website is important to any marketer. Everyone knows that the higher the ranking of the site, the more traffic to the website. SiteChecker's website checker service can be one such tool. And now I will show you everything with an illustrative example. Be careful not to miss the most important thing. SiteChecker Pro is a software that gives you the ability to conduct SEO audits of websites, as well as organize part of the search engine optimization process, analyze and track your SEO keywords to improve rankings in Google and other search engines. And while your ranking is highly dependent on the SEO expert you work with, SiteChecker is definitely the tool an expert needs to help your site achieve the ranking and recognition it deserves. This platform specializes in search engine optimization. It checks for errors such as meta titles, meta descriptions, tags, page sizes, loading speed, images, and other metrics. SiteChecker Pro provides an SEO score as well as a list of technical bugs and recommended updates. You can also scan to find all external and internal links that are associated with the website. The tool detects both critical errors and critical error warnings. The tool will tell you how to fix these errors. SiteChecker will show you how to fix mistakes with your titles and subheadings. If you want to search engine traffic, you need to build links to your site. SiteChecker Pro will tell you how your link building work is progressing. SiteChecker has a plugin. If you download the plugin, you don't have to enter your website URL every time you want to check your competitors' metrics. SiteChecker comes in 10 different languages. You are allowed to use the site to check your SEO scores as often as you want. Upon entering the site, you will be presented with a welcome screen that will take you to the main control panel. In the Project tab, you enter a website of your choice to create a new project where you can audit. You can see all the characteristics, errors and warnings of your site by going through all the features that this site has to offer. These features are located in the left sidebar on the website. You also have a Projects tab in the sidebar if you want to go back to the first page where all your projects are located. When you create a new project, the following sections will appear at the top of your project. Site Audit. This shows the overall SEO rank your site has achieved on Site Checkup. Below, you can see errors, warnings and other notices of your site. Rank Tracking. This is where you can add keywords you are trying to push for the website. The site will then check and display your ranking among Google Sites. The Site Monitoring section is a site dashboard that displays the daily changes to your site. For example, this will display the number of pages, the page description or any other changes that your site went through on a daily basis. Traffic. This section will display your traffic. This traffic will be the all and organic traffic that your site has witnessed. But in order for the app to crawl your website and display traffic, you will need to connect your Google Analytics account, which is pretty standard. Once you go to the toolbar, you will see the various sections in more detail than on the projects page. In the projects tab, you might have seen the traffic tab, but when you click on it, it directs you to the dashboard tab where you can see all the traffic in more detail. Here you can see a small chart of your site's growth over the day. You can also see the percentage of increase or loss in your website traffic. To view this traffic, you need to connect your Google Analytics account. Organic traffic is the audience that came to your site through a search engine, not through paid advertising. To view this traffic, you need to connect your Google Analytics account. In this section, you can see a graph of the increase or decrease of your audience by a certain percentage. The next section is Site Evaluation. Here you can see the score of your site, which is evaluated according to the parameters set by Site Checker. Analyzing SERPs is a very important part of your website's SEO. With this analysis, you can track the top rank signs and whether it is worth spending time on the keywords you are trying to rank. 
In the search results analysis section, you can see the forecasts of all competitors' sites. You can sort them by day, a week, month. You can also enter exact start and end dates if you want a little more control over your results. In addition, you can sort the chart by various positional checks, such as no position, top 1, top 3, top 10, top 30, top 50, top 100. Keywords in the top 100. The next section is keywords in the top 100. Here you can see the number of keywords of your project that are in the top 100 search results. The percentage in brackets is the percentage of the number of keywords. The bottom section shows the dynamic range of changes that have occurred on the website since the previous date. The out of position section provides a count of all keywords used in your project that are not in the top 100 search results. The percentage in brackets represents the total number of keywords. Top 100 Keywords of Visibility in Search Results In this section, you can see the forecast of the top 100 keywords in a specific time period. There is a section at the top where you can set dates according to your needs and requirements. In the top keyword section, you can see the main keywords that can be seen when you click on the Google Search Console. From there, you can get an idea of what people are basically looking for. Google Analytics must be enabled on your website to display the graph. When this scroll process is complete, you will see your traffic showing up in blue projects and any rights and follow the website should show up to you. There is also a second section called Sales. Here you can see all your planned sales if your business data is connected to Site Checker. The next item on the sidebar after the dashboard is Site Audit. Here you have two more sections, Summary and Problems. Summary. In this section, you can track the entire status of your website as well as all the necessary rating and characteristics of your website to compile a detailed report. In this section, you will see the rating of your site as well as the following characteristics, critical error warnings, notices. The second section of Site Audit is Problems. If you want to view the full report or want complete information on these three issues, critical errors, warnings and notifications, simply click on the button below them to display the details. Regarding Site Monitoring, here you can track the number of web pages, any changes in the description or any other small or large changes that have occurred in your site on the last 24 hours. After monitoring a site, the next item on the sidebar is the Rank Tracking feature. Here you can track the ranking of your site according to various filters. For example, positions, unit, page, group, ranging, date. In the Track Backlink section, you can see a list of all websites that are projecting your content. And if you want to search for a specific URL, you can do so using the separate search bar at the top. Like all the great tools and solutions on the internet, the best ones come with the price tag. The good news is that with the rise of SAAS, the cost of extremely advanced and expensive solutions are now more affordable than ever before. This is exactly what you will find with Start Checker. Anyone can visit the site and create an account for free. However, in order to start using all the features and access the keyword reporting, you need to upgrade to one of the following plans. Basic $19 a month, 3 websites, 150 keywords. Startup $29 per month, 5 sites, 500 keywords. Growth $69 per month, 10 websites, 1000 keywords. Depending on your site's needs and budget, the basic and startup plans are the most popular as they are fairly affordable and allow you to add 3 to 5 sites to your account. It is also possible to further reduce monthly rates by subscribing for a year in advance. This will result in savings of 20%. Now you know how to check your website for SEO errors. In fact, there are over 100 metrics that the tool shows you about your website. Many website builders cannot afford to outsource a professional SEO company. Site Checker Pro will provide your website with a complete SEO audit. Thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for more videos.